Hey everybody, it's Wednesday, June 11th, 2014, and I wanted to do a video today on the harvest from this morning. Things are finally starting to come in, uh, so let's take a look and see what we got. I'm going to try to hold the camera and do this, so we'll see. We have a bunch of purple jalapenos. Now, you can see half of them are this purplish black, and then the other half or parts of them are green. They could go a lot longer on the plant and be totally purple and then go from purple to red but we wanted to use these for something particular tonight so I went ahead and picked them I've got a bunch of those so a nice handful of those we have several zucchini nice size one Another nice one. And then we have this really weird zucchini. I don't know if it was cross-pollinated with something. Maybe the yellow squash because it's sort of... It just is... It's darker than the rest. And it's got this really skinny body with a big fat end. It almost looks like a crooked neck squash. So, kind of weird. Uh, there's another... Jalapeno. These are what I'm proud of. These are the patty pan squash flying saucer. I have several. The color is just really cool. I think we're gonna stuff these later. So the patty pans, like I said, you can do a lot with these. You can quarter them, saute them. We tried a recipe that we found on YouTube the other day. We quartered them sauteed them in olive oil and then added uh, tarragon that was pretty good you can cut the stems off and they'll sit perfectly upright and then cut the top out scoop the insides out stuff them slice them fry them you know the same thing you do with any summer squash but just really really cool the plants are really neat um, and you know especially this one it's about it's shorter and fatter but it's about the same I should weigh them but it's about the same size as, as a small zucchini, so anyway, that's what we harvested today. Probably going to do some jalapeno poppers or stuffed, jalap stuffed grilled jalapenos tonight and stuff these um, patted pan squash with probably some rice and meat and tomatoes. and, and uh, Anyway, so things are starting to come in. Thanks for watching.